me out. Come on, I know my rights. I'm allowed one phone call. Help, let me out. Oh, hi everybody. And welcome to the Trevor Carpenter Photo Challenge. I'm not really in jail. I'm in a box stall. Actually, Aztec's box stall. And right next to me, I've got ladies' box stall. I'm at my friend's ranch, my friend Claude and Esther's ranch, the Mistook Ranch. And it is actually the perfect place to introduce this week's photo challenge. But before I tell you what it is, follow me outside and we'll introduce you to Aztec and Lady. Right here, I've got Lady. And to my right, Aztec. Now, this week's challenge, very appropriate. Pets, domesticated and domestic animal portraits. Very simple, whether you're at home, on a farm, on a ranch like I am right now, you can go out and take a simple animal portrait. We're trying to keep this very COVID-19 friendly as usual. And if you think taking pictures of horses and horses are big animals, wait till you see the size of the dogs in this house. So here I am by the pool with Lily and Jules. Two good, very good kissers. Not too enjoyable to kiss once they finish drinking though. Now, when it comes to pet photography, uh, there's actually people who make a living out of that. Just like we have w uh, wedding photographers, we have uh, portrait photographers, sports photographers. There's actually pet photographers. And they actually make a very good living. And a few searches on Google uh, will reveal quite a few photographers that are actually specialized in pet photography. And that can vary from, you know, your house pets from dogs, birds, cats, to actually livestock as well. And people actually have show uh, horses, show cows, and, uh, and different types of livestock that actually compete with in shows. So it's actually quite popular to get your animal photographs to do some publicity, especially when breeding comes into play. Uh, it's just the only way to sell uh, the potential your animal has online with video and photography. And naturally, no pet challenge would be complete without the kitty cat. Here's Leo. Leo's a Bengal cat. He's actually still quite young, although a year old. He's still not adult. He'll be growing till he's 18 months old, but he's a great subject for photography. Again, thank you for being part of the Trevor Carpenter Photo Challenge. I'd like to extend a really, really, really special thank you to my friend Claude and Esther for letting us film here at the Mistook Ranch this weekend for the Photo Challenge Pet and domesticated and domestic animal portrait challenge. Until next time, thank you. And remember, the sky's the limit at the Trevor Carpenter photo challenge.